Hi everybody, this is Henry Li from BlueHeronArts.com. Today we're going to do a special mood seal for Jean.、Um, she's a student in my online Chinese brush painting class, and this seal says uh, um, "sorrow written on sand" and "blessing or happiness carved on stone." It's a very nice、um, saying. I translated into Chinese as a "bei hua sha xi ke shi." Very poetic.、Um, I made a transfer.、Uh, you can see with a, a laser、uh, printout, and、uh, with this special liquid called、uh, acetone.、Um, you can transfer it by rubbing it on the. Stone. So you、uh, see if we make an imprint from the stamp.、Uh, however, in the process of transferring,、uh, something happened. So it gave me some uh, uh, accidental effects. I call it、uh, divine inspirations. So I'm going to、uh, keep this、uh, imperfect uh, print, uh, you know, the perfect of、uh, perfection of.、Uh, Imperfect、uh, is the idea. So the stone is round, but I'm not going to、uh, probably make it a, a more natural shaped、uh, instead of a perfect round stone as a,、uh, this computer printout. So it's a negative carving style. So we carve out the stroke. I use a small knife, as if like a small brush. So we use different、uh, pressure to control the thickness of the line by lifting and、uh, pressing. This is the 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 phonetical part. Which is a bay? It's a bay. Is north.、Uh, the, the lower part is uh, uh, the heart radical. Sorrow has to do with heart. Sand, a, a jaw actually on top. So I I can carve in different order than writing, but、uh, let me keep this. So the next character is、uh, jaw or written. Sorry, I'm missing.
feel like carved on the sand. That's a kind of a feeling. So that has to be very fluent without hesitation. Okay, now we're going to do the second uh, part. Happiness. This is the mouth vertical, make it uh, like a smiley. Engrave or carve. It's this that I'm doing on the stone. Perfect uh, saying for this uh, uh, mood seal on soapstone. It will last forever. This part is the knife. Oh, the last character is stone. Now I'm going to make uh, some uh, some uh, chipping um, or for the edge. It's on purpose to make it uh, imperfect. This is a very traditional way of making the uh, edge. We call it uh, knocking out the edge because this uh, way the ink, I mean the seal, will not be imitated. Uh, reproduced. It's an authentic uh, mark. It has a sort 
special charm uh, to this kind of art. Also, the random effect. Okay, let me clean it up. Let me make an imprint, see how it looks like. Now, I'm ready to make an imprint. See how it looks like. Wow. It's pretty cool. I like the kind of the natural texture. Uh, it's like an ancient uh, rubbing of uh, steely uh, or uh, stone carved inscriptions you know the um, calligraphy on a stone and then you make a rubbing that's kind of feeling uh, I purposely made this more like sorrow in my um, imagination so uh, this one is more broken and like sand, everything on sand, this is more clear on the stone. Um, anyway, just a little bit, uh, but it's not a painting, but it's calligraphy art. Alright, next I'm going to uh, ma uh, make another to see if it's uh, better. of a round seal is always a kind of challenge so I need to make a, a mark something on, on the side so the uh, user can tell which side is uh, at the uh, correct orientation you need to press harder if you want less granny and load more ink Now I'm going to make an official stamp in the oven. Press very hard. Okay, perfect. Now I'm going to make uh, another 
imprint on this special paper for Jin. Another seal to carve for Jin and uh, please stay tuned. Thank everybody on YouTube for watching and uh, thank Jin for your special commission for this mood seal. Uh, if anybody need a mood seal or name chop, please contact us at uh, blueheronarts.com. Goodbye.